My, my, take a look at you. Will you take a look at you? You look like you've seen trouble, mister. Enough for a hundred men. Well, trouble has a way of finding me, mister. Do I like the sound of that? Do I ever like the sound of that? Trouble with a capital T. That's just capital. Whatever you say. Cold, tough, but with a heart of gold. The cowboy sings his lonely song like, like a dog whose bone is made of wood. Excuse me? Oh, nothing. I, I was just writing my next piece. I've been sent out here to provide a little frontier joie de vivre for the ladies back east. I don't understand a word you say, mister. Yeah, my ma felt the same way. And now she wrote me out of her will, and there's no hope for any of us. <laughs> uh, Jimmy Saint, sir, at your disposal. But uh, please don't dispose of me just yet. <laughs> so what are you doing down here, Jimmy? Capturing the spirit of the West for a monthly back east. You know, I'm uh, sending them my oh-so-witty and oh-so-pertinent missives and gaining myself a little prize in the bargain. So it's action I'm after, and action I'm going to find, too. <laughs> Wild men, cheap women, you know, guns, that sort of thing. Well, you have fun. Fun? <laughs> I'm going to have the time of my life, sport. I tell you, mister, the time of my little old life. <laughs> Them bastards and gap tooth breeds got my friend, Floyd. Please, mister, you gotta help him. I'm in a bad way. I gotta get to a doctor. He was in the rail house when they jumped us. Maybe he's still around there. I'm truly indebted to you, partner, but don't you worry, cause I've got a way to repay that debt. Sons of bitches are hiding treasure in those caves. My friend and I was about to swipe it when they got me. Don't know where he got to. Anyways, if you get us to the mouth of the cave, I can show you where it is on your map. Get up here! Good work, partner! All right, so here's where the treasure's at. You get me there and you get your share. You have my word. This one's for you, Paul. We're heading this 
away. You have to keep up! Jimmy? Nobody told me you were a miner. I'm not, Sport. This is the first time that I've ever been underground. But I like getting a preview of being buried. It should be fun, but not funny. What? Your eastern wit is wasted on my dumb western brain, Sport. Oh, don't worry. You're not missing much. I'm beginning to think that this article will be better written on a tropical island in the arms of a beautiful maiden. Interesting idea. Now, can we get out of here? Yes, please. Hello to you too! Over there! I'm gonna die here! back there. One measly chest? Well, it's all yours, partner, for your troubles. I'm a man of my word.
free, will ya? Thanks, sport. You are a true American hero. Right. Now, what are you doing here? Well, I just thought I'd see a little bit of the local color, you know. But these gentlemen have seen to it that I've enjoyed the true hospitality of the frontier. Hey, uh, cigar? Let's get out of here. Right. I figure an extra gun never hurts. Gracias, amigo! The pendejos killed two of my men and captured another! We must save him! What kind of fake outlaws are you? Are you going to make this interesting or not? Look out, officer. Get his in the the uh, a little wilder than I thought. Damn sport. You really are someone to be riding the river with. I think you've done outlived your welcome down these parts, Jimmy. I'd get out while the going's good. Oh, you're right about that. There is something about nearly dying several times that hasn't given the old muse the kick up the backside that I was expecting. I can't write a joke for a pile of fresh turd. No more of this cowboy business for old Jimmy. I think I might take up music or war reporting. <laughs> 